Securian leaders, please join me in welcoming to the stage, Ryan Estes. I've not heard Ryan speak before. Great energy, uh, great storyteller, and some really good practical advice. There's an approach, a practice to leadership that actually can become a catalyst for growth and sustain competitive advantage. And, and that approach is human-centered. This is already in our short list because of the focus on human-centered leadership being something that we want to embrace and carry forward at Securian. And then we looked further into his work and found just so much alignment in that philosophy and how we need to do that here. He, Human-centered organizations outperform their competitive set. They're innovative. They move with the agility and speed of their customers. Hearing some of the thoughts and ideas that go into uh, the history of leadership that he's had with his various teams uh, and some of the some of the thoughts around uh, really leading yourself as you lead through change I think that really resonated very closely with me honestly it out delivered everything that we expected coming in we had such a great prep call with Ryan he came on campus we talked we felt really aligned in the messaging that we were hoping he could deliver we shared a lot of who we are and what we're hoping to accomplish and he took that away, clearly studied it, because when he came in, just hit everything with such great alignment, connection, synergy. You know, when I spent time with your team, we were doing a little bit of pre-work, and I looked at some of the language and the positioning, I said, okay, God, you have behaviors. That's modeling, right? You're gonna be the example of the Securian culture. You're gonna model the right behaviors. Care is a value of yours. It's deeply embedded to the fabric of who you are as an organization. If there was a two centimeter shift, it's thinking of yourself as a coach. Yeah, le leader, the future of leadership really is about coaching. As I've had a chance to debrief with some people and as I was looking around the room as he was speaking, I saw that he was really resonating and connecting on a deep personal level. I could see this kind of emotional reaction, tears, laughs, smiles, body language, people leaning in. It was very clear that people were connecting to Ryan.